What's going on guys, Chung Chow here, today I'm going to bring you another Minecraft mod review, and this is going to be the Atomic Bomb mod, and this is a really cool mod, however it does pretty much destroy your computer if you use it, it basically made my computer poop itself because it was lagging so bad, but it is pretty unique and pretty cool, so this is the Atomic Bomb mod, I'm going to show you how to craft it first like I always do, so you're going to make an X with some gunpowder, and you're going to put TNT in the outer edges and you get an atomic bomb. Actually I should have made more of these. Let's see. Probably only gonna set off one before my computer dies. I do have a very high-end computer but my computer cannot handle this. It can handle TNT fine. Like I can set off as much TNT as I want and nothing. But this thing it's just ridiculous how powerful this is. So I'm gonna set down the atomic bomb Right there seems pretty good. Nice radius around here. Actually, ah, yeah, that's good. And actually, the way to set this off is you're going to need to have a redstone line. It does not set off with anything like uh, levers. You need a redstone line that is at least three blocks away from the atomic bomb. So I'm going to go pretty far away so I kind of make my computer not lag as much because it is pretty bad. Like, are you. Okay. So, I'm going to see how far away I can get. Uh, stupid vines in the way. Okay, so let's go up here. Right there. And, obviously the redstone line does have to be active in order for this to work. Let's see how far away I am. Oh, I did not make it far. I'm very bad at laying redstone. Uh, come here. There we go. So... I will show you the blast. I will go in creative mode so I can uh, kind of fly up more. Okay, so I'm going to put it in creative mode now and enable flying. So, right, there we go. Enable flying so I can get away fast. Put down the redstone torch and it's going to make it soon. And you'll see that start to flash. Actually, okay, so it's. Is it lighting? It's gone. Okay. Yes, no. Oh, I think I placed the redstone torch too far away. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, I guess I have to go pretty close with the redstone torch. I'm just going to have to fly away. I did not think of that. Really? Really? No. Of course. No. Nope. Okay, I guess it's not going to work. Nope, not going to happen. Okay. So, I'm going to have to do it this way. Bummer. Let's get some redstone up in here. That was a waste of time. So let's get some redstone and let's just do it like that and run for our lives because this is going to be very. Oh my god, what is going on? I swear I can get this to work. I'm just gonna do it three way. Let's try that. Nope, not gonna happen. Okay, I don't really know what's going on right now. Let's try putting this in the ground maybe? Yes. Oh, that, that did it. That did it. Uh, let's see. Oh, there goes my computer. It just set off, and I'm currently getting zero. That is right, zero. Four. Four is better. Four. Three. Three FPS. And you should start to see a large crater. Actually, it didn't make that big of a hole. It kind of... That was kind of weird. It has a huge blast radius, though. Like the, uh, the area it affects. Yep, here we go. See, now you're starting to see the hole. It is absolutely massive, and for some reason, my FPS never comes back. Like, I've waited 10 minutes, and it's still at 4 or 3. Okay, let's see if we can render all this real quick. Okay, and we get in there, so we can render it. That was a pretty big waste of time when I was lighting the redstone before without it in the ground, but whatever. So, ah, oh man, I'm tired. Okay, so, there we go. I think it is just about done rendering, hopefully. No? I think I actually found a cave. But yeah, this is how big the blast radius is. It is way, 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 way bigger than TNT. It is, like, absolutely massive. And it's deeper than just this. It, like, creates weird holes, kind of like how bedrock is. Okay, so I'm pretty far in here. Let's see how 
tall it is. Sorry for my 1 FPS. This is what happens with this. I've warned you guys. Okay, let's fly. Yes. Fly? No? Okay. So, I guess that's going to be the end of this video, guys. If you want to experience this major lagging on your computer, you can download it in the description below. It is pretty fun to mess around with, but your computer will suffer. And, yeah. So that is going to be the end of this mod review. I'm sorry for the stupidity in the beginning, but that's how the way it goes. So, thanks for watching, guys.